Hey again, take two. Well, now I'm sitting outside here that maybe this would make a difference. And we turned the uh, phone sideways. So hopefully this works. Okay, Carvel, where are you? This won't be a long video because it is breezy out here and getting chilly and it does not feel like summer anymore. <laughs> And so I will make this quick. I promise. All right. Looks like you're here. Well, now it doesn't even say that I can invite you on. This is just so weird. Okay. Here we go. Yes. Try again. Here we go. I'm going to be adding you. So, oh, yeah, it's connecting. Hey. Yeah, it worked. Awesome. Technically challenged, yeah, but that's okay. Just a little. It must have been because I had my phone vertical. But I switched mine to vertical, too. I'm shiny. I know. Don't you love it? I got a zit on my nose, so whatever. Ah! <laughs> Who cares? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was just saying, this won't be a long video. It is chilly here and it's breezy. It was um, this morning at, like, noon. It was 54 degrees. What? That's crazy. I know. So... Um, you guys, we wanted to visit with you all and just share our stories about what this thing is all about anyway. And, you know, we, both of us now have been promoters for four and a half years. And when I think about that, I'm like, what, how can this be? But the cool thing is, you know, I started out as a customer, not a promoter. And I wasn't very confident that this product would work because I had tried all the new things on the market. And... I quickly found out by about my second week that I felt really, really good. So then I started sharing it with friends and Carmel is one of those friends that I shared it with. So Carmel, tell me a little bit about how that all happened. Well, that's just, okay, let's, let's just be real. I was a skeptic yeah. and I saw three other people post about thrive before you did mm -hmm. and i'll be honest as soon as you started thriving i'm like oh no not her <laughs> what is happening and so i would say four months maybe three months goes by mm -hmm. you actually called me you didn't set me up with a free account but you called me and you said how are you and at that point i was just exhausted um stressed out financially couldn't sleep at night i i think i told you i think something's wrong with me because i'm always tired yeah and you said wait hold on <laughs> <laughs> so that's when you know i wasn't expecting you to to share a thrive with me at that point but i literally left the door wide open because i was sick and tired of being tired and i was seeing your post as well as other people's posts say how awesome they were feeling. Mm -hmm. And even though I didn't need a weight loss, I wanted to feel as good as you guys did. Yeah. So that's where that happened. Totally. Well, and I'm curious of everyone watching who was skeptical before they started thriving, because it is very, very common to be skeptical because of course you have no idea what it is. You don't know how it works. You don't know how much it costs. You can't see the value in it, you know, and every, uh, what I've real, here's what I've realized having been in business this long, um, promoting thrive is a confused mind says no. So mm -hmm. if you don't fully understand what this product could do for you and how simple it is and how it could literally change your life, of course, you're going to say no. So promoters don't take it personally when someone tells them no, because most of us said no in the beginning anyway. And so I, I, I just think that for me, it was the, the m most significant benefit that I noticed right away was oh, sleeping at night. Immediate, like within two weeks, sleeping through the night, um, more energy, I noticed that I was motivated to go to the gym and actually work out. Whereas before, no joke, there were many times I would go to the gym and sit in my car on my phone and not work out at all, like literally. And, or I would go in and just like go on the treadmill for 20 minutes walking and tell myself I was working out. Like that's where I was at and not drinking enough water. I was always swinging through a coffee shop drive through or grabbing the coffee when I shopped around Target. 
you know, it was so crazy to think back to those times when I just didn't um, prioritize me. Really, that's what it boils down to. I was not taking care of myself. I didn't prioritize myself. And that tells me I didn't actually value myself. Right. And right. so I recall in those days being very irritable up with my kids and very irritable with my husband and very irritable about our financial situation. <laughs> like, those were a lot of the reasons I was up at night. Who can relate? Like, yeah. <laughs> like, like, for you all watching, what was your your first benefit that you noticed in how Thrive worked and also what was the most nagging like annoying part about every day that you just accepted as life because for me I accepted as life being tired all the time always counting down the hours to when I got to go back to bed whether it was a nap or early to bed um just I just thought that I was never going to be a morning person that I was never going to um, have the energy to do what I needed to do. That's just because, and I thought, Oh, I'm turning 40. That's just the way it is when we turn 40. Yes, exactly. <laughs> That's, oh, this is how I'm supposed to feel. My uh -huh. hands aren't supposed to be working properly. I'm supposed to be moody. I'm supposed to be exhausted. <laughs> um, and just, I think when you, and you will agree with me on this, I'm sure, when you have financial stresses, it takes hold of you and your sleep. Yeah. And you can't go into a restful sleep because as soon as you wake up, yes. you, go, you instantly go back to the thoughts. Yeah. So um, I would say once you corrected my steps, because I was taking it wrong, Yes. <laughs> um, I would say that. When I woke up on day seven, just the mental clarity was clear. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then the energy and the mood support was probably the biggest things that I noticed right yep. away, which I hadn't had. But I did notice on day four, which was the day that I corrected my steps, that I slept like a baby. Yeah. Like I fell asleep super fast. As soon as, as, soon as I laid down to rest, my eyes shut and I was off to La La Land within minutes, as opposed to the 45 to an hour that it used to be. Oh, so, so true. I know. Yeah. It's so funny. Well, so I want, I want to make this really a productive video for people. So we also want to talk about the three simple steps so that you can click the share button and share with your friends that are skeptical um, how simple our three steps are, why this product works, and obviously they can read through the comments to see all of the benefits that, that everyone is experiencing. So you can click the share button. And of course, if anyone messaged me that was connected to you all, I would send them right back to you because I'm all about integrity. Um, so what are these three simple steps that we're talking about? If you guys know them, drop a comment. What are the three simple steps and when do you take them? All right, I'll, ch I'll tell you since I don't see your comments. First thing in the morning, on an empty stomach, you keep your three steps by the bedside. Do you have yours there handy? I do. I've got the first two steps here handy. I don't have any yes. EFT in my purse and I'm not at my house. So <laughs> I was like, oh darn. Um, so anyway, it's three simple steps. You take them first thing in the morning on an empty stomach. You keep these capsules by your bedside. I'll give you all a little hint. You want to change your life, use that time between when you take your capsule and the 20 to 40 minutes later when you make your lifestyle mix with your choice of liquid, use that time for personal development, reading an inspiring book, listening to a meditation. And my favorite meditation is the Breathe app or Abide. Both of them are meditation apps. Maximize that time when you're, you're just waking up. And you now have decided that you're going to change your life and you want a lifestyle change. So adopt these three simple steps, but add this little component of getting your mind right. And you're going to change everything about your life. I promise you. Mm -hmm. So again, you take your capsule one or two. I take one. How about you, Carmel? I take one. I take one men's. Oh, you do men's. And I do one yes. women's first thing in the morning. No hair on my stomach. chest, people. Right? No hair on my chest. She's all good. And I like to listen to my breathe app and my abide app um, while I wait my 20 to 40 minutes for my lifestyle mix. What about you? I do my uh, devotional, my Jesus Calling book. It's a turquoise book. Yep. Every morning before I come downstairs to make my shake. Yay. 
I know, and I'm really lucky because Rob brings me my shake in bed every day. <laughs> I'm like, normally up before everybody in this house. I know. Well, so in our family, he's the early riser. I love sleeping in and I love, love, love my cozy bed. And he loves to bring me that because it's kind of a great time for us to connect. And I'm just waking up and I've already done my meditation. And, and usually, you guys, guess what time that is? It's at 8.30. <laughs> But we homeschool and I work from home and that's how we've designed our lives. And I'm not ashamed to say it. How about you? Tell them your routine. What do you, what um, flavor so, do you drink, you all? What flavor? Right now I'm liking strawberry. Mm. So 30 minutes later, I drink my strawberry lifestyle mix. I, do, I drink a full shake uh, with eight ounces of water, not milk, eight ounces of water. And I have a reusable straw. Yeah, me too. I just take that down. Yay. So Super easy, super, super easy, and super yummy because it's ultra micronized. Oh, and it doesn't, it's not chunky at all. I remember, Carmel, uh -uh. when we first started, there were some other shake companies that were big on the market, and I was trying a few different things, thinking, oh, I got to get more protein in my diet, and um, they were so chunky and, like, chalky, and so when I first learned about this, I was like, ugh, how can I drink this every day? Gross. Like, that was my fear. But you all, I've got to tell you something incredible about our lifestyle mix. And we have different flavors. Everyone comment your flavor. Mine is vanilla, and it has been for almost five years straight. Five years straight. Sometimes mm -hmm. I'll even take one of these um, for, like, my mid-afternoon snack, especially if I'm doing a detox, which Carmel and I are going to be leading for you all in the next week or so. Um, but basically, what's cool about this product is that it gives you your probiotics, and prebiotics and enzymes. Now, why is that important? Because it helps gut health. When we rebalance the gut health, and the Thrive Experience does this most efficiently. I mean, I've tried other probiotics, et cetera, on the market, and I never actually experienced the change that I did with this and the detox that I went through at that time because I definitely didn't have a healthy gut population. <laughs> and also, <laughs> if we're all honest, like, who was pooping regularly before the Thrive Experience? Like, this is a serious problem in our nation, and I'm not kidding. Like, once this, um, people start to get things moving, they rebalance the gut health, they, you will notice, here's how cool, but you will notice um, that you'll have less bloating, and you might experience some bloating as you get started because the gut health is rebalancing, and there will be a lot of off-gassing as the little mm -hmm. organisms are going through the little life cycle more quickly because of what's in Thrive, and then that rebalances the gut health. Now, as the, the gut health is rebalanced, what you notice is you improve your immune system, you reduce inflammation in the body, the joints, um, your, maybe if you had discomfort in your stomach or a headache, or maybe um, you notice that well, like I said, go back a little to the part where I said about the bloating you might experience at first. That is a good thing. You might be going to the bathroom more often. That is a good thing. You might even get constipated at first because, mm -hmm. again, your gut health is a um, – if you think of it as a symphony orchestra and there's all of those different instruments that play together to make the beautiful music, this is what happens, and your body is highly efficient at eliminating toxins that you are exposed to or in your diet. But the thing is, if you have had bad habits every day for a long time, which for most people is uh, pretty much their entire lives, maybe their adult lives, it's just, well, probably their entire lives. For me, I, probably yes. But what I noticed was, again, a little bit of bloating, some discomfort in my joints as I went through my detox at first, which was very normal. And I knew this because I had, um, Rob is a physician assistant in sports nutrition and orthopedics. And he knew about this. So he said, you know, he understood that. And what I realized, like, I wanted to get through it because I didn't want to um, have that imbalance anymore. Like I wanted the healthy gut flora. That's what we call all the little organisms, the billions and billions of them. And um, that's what we call that little gut flora. And I wanted that to be healthy because I knew my immune system starts in your gut. Your emotional health also is affected by gut health, you all. And so 
that was good. Like I wanted to get through that so that I could get to the other side. And by week two, I was like, whoa, it was so incredible how I felt. How about you? It took me, um, day 10 was when I noticed that I was regular, Yeah. but I was a little, um, off and on, I'd be a little more tired after day seven, which I also know is part of an yes. adjustment period. Yes. But I think it's really important that you did point out how this shake is so different than all the other shakes. Mm -hmm. Because I think a lot of people think that our shake is like all other shakes that are yeah. on the market. Mm -hmm. And it's not. It no. really is to improve the gut health. And so mm -hmm. many people, mainly what I experience with women is that they do get constipated in the beginning Yeah, because their body is adjusting right. and they're not drinking enough water. Yes. So, and, and probably they were relying on consuming a lot of coffee or tea first thing in the morning, which got things moving, right? Mm -hmm. Yes. Now, yes, yes, yes. our three steps contain less than a cup of coffee. That's Absolutely. pretty incredible. And here's the thing. There is something very special in this life stomachs. I don't know if you all knew this, but prebiotics are a form of fiber that actually feed the good bacteria, the probiotics. That's why people might experience some feeling of gassiness or bloating initially because the prebiotic, that fiber, is feeding the probiotic so that that colony grows. Very, it's super fascinating. Now, um... I'm, I desperately want to start talking about our new challenge we're going to be announcing next week, but I'm not going to. So you all click the follow button and stay tuned because you're going to want to be part of it. And I'm often the type of person who likes to jump the gun when I need to actually lay the foundation first. <laughs> <laughs> so stay tuned and click the follow button so that you're notified. You, you can click, um, there's three little dots on your screen right there. If you tap that, you'll be able to click follow or see first on this video. Um, Carmel, what else, what do, you, what do you think is important for people watching this video to know if they are considering starting their Thrive experience? I think because of my personal experience of not following the steps, the steps are very important. And um, it's not something that you can take on a full stomach. It's not something that you can wait two hours later to drink your shake. It's not something that you drink coffee in between each step. It is very specific because each step is synergistically working together. Mm -hmm. um, and here's the thing, like fine tuning what is not working or what needs to work for you yeah. is also key and that open communication I know there's not a lot of people that do this, but I know on my team, it's really important to have that open communication because we can help you through. Yep. Majority of the things that people might be experienced that don't fall in the category of thriving typically is an adjustment period, something that you're doing. It's not thrive. It's something that needs just to be tweaked. So following the steps is so important. And here's the biggest part. Like you cannot get the results by taking it here and there, you have to be consistent. It is a lifestyle change. It's not a diet. It's not a fad. Um, it is a lifestyle change for overall health and wellness. And, you know, with school starting and my kids go to school, I last year I didn't get sick, knock on wood. And they probably got sick two to three times, uh, which is less than normal. So, um, I know that Thrive has definitely helped me help support my immune system. Um, again, from the three simple steps that we're taking is giving us what we need overall for our health and wellness. And we have one body in this lifetime. I we know. upgrade our phones all the time. We upgrade our cars. We upgrade our computers. But for those people that aren't thriving and that don't know, um, what the upgrade feels like as a thriver. Yeah. Um, you have one lifetime, one body, one life upgrade if you're not feeling 100%. Mm -hmm. And I totally. used to believe that eating right and exercising were what you needed. However, I couldn't get there because I was so tired. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> so true. And so, so. Funny. and here's something I've learned, you guys. This is incredible research as well. If you're not getting adequate quality sleep at night, you will hold on to pounds 
versus mm-hmm. someone who is getting eight to 10 hours of sleep at night, they will release the weight. There's some, there's a different, there's like a hormonal play happening. And if you don't get the adequate sleep, you will be more likely to be heavier. So this is another side benefit of the Thrive Experience is people sleep better and then they're more li- more likely to easily release the weight. And, um, uh, oh. and moody. Right. Moodiness that goes hand in hand with that. Absolutely. Absolutely. So three steps. Again, it's your capsule. First thing in the morning with a full glass of water. 20 minutes later, make your lifestyle mix. I make mine with organic whole milk. Some people do almond milk or um, coconut milk or water. And something that my husband does, which is a really good idea. I just don't like the taste because I love the vanilla flavor so much. But he makes a, a boost of eight lifestyle mix every morning so he does boost activate and lifestyle mix because he is all about nutrition like i said and he understands that boost is an alkaline um, product that helps your body get the greens that it needs to be more alkaline when you're more alkaline your immune system is better fighting um something that i probably can't say on line so i'm not going to <laughs> but we're likely to fight it let's just say that um and the so then he puts on he loves dft duo i usually use black label or just the regular dft how about you I, right now i have burn on oh you do um but i my favorite is black label mm-hmm. so yeah yeah sometimes I have one black label with one traditional dft if I have low backache, yep. I will definitely use incongruent with my black label, yeah. the, the, the two by two. You mean in, conju- in conjunction? In, yes, in conjunction. Incongruent sorry. means not. <laughs> okay. I think, yes. Does anyone have questions? If you do, drop them in the comments. We'll answer them. Otherwise, I think that this has been an awesome live stream. And hopefully you guys have loved it and gotten lots of information that has been helpful that you can share. And just know this, that we have something really fun coming out in the next week. We're planning for the 10th, but I'm thinking maybe we have to do it after our trip to Florida. Just yeah. so that everyone's not rushed. Okay, yeah. so we're going to aim for septem- mid-September, right around the 18th, I think. Sound good? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yes. Okay, good. Definitely. Actually... You know what? That ju- I just was reminded of something. Our our bodies naturally go through a seasonal detox. And what happens around the third week of September? Who knows? Third fall. <laughs> exactly. Seasons change. <laughs> <laughs> it's the equinox. Uh huh. Mm-hmm. And so we're going into the last season of 2018, which is fall, and it's a great time to do a detox, a reset, help you get your um, habits back in, in alignment before mm-hmm. we go into the holiday season, because the average person gains 10 to 15 pounds during the holiday season. So make the decision today. I'm not available to gain 10 to 15 pounds this year. No, yeah. I am 100% going to take care of myself, prioritize myself, and I'm going to have the best holiday season ever. And then that will take you into winter time and New Year's. And at that point, we will come up upon doing another detox Detox. challenge like the one we're announcing. And Mm -hmm. it's going to be incredible for you guys. We're going to do these every quarter. And for about four weeks, reset, really resetting and helping you really focus on your daily habits Mm -hmm. for optimal health and wellness for optimal weight loss. And and I don't even like to call it weight loss. I like to say releasing the weight, like, like you just not available for that (laughs) 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 because, because like, really that's, you want it to be a lifestyle thing that lasts for your lifetime. Not mm-hmm. something that you keep yo-yoing about around with the food or, you know, the extreme diets or the extreme uh, workouts. So we want to teach you daily habits that will support you in a lifetime of weight loss, optimal health, wellness, and Mindset. energy. Mm-hmm. And you all, you all, your health is your future. Mm, absolutely. You don't take care of you and you get sick down the road or something happens. Mm-hmm. Like, ah, 
It's the worst. I know because I threw my back out a while ago and it was a result of me not working out for years. Remember that when I did that? Yes, I oh. do. It was awful. It lasted an entire year. That's yeah. It was awful. It was before I started thriving. Um, Life actually, was so grand back then. <laughs> right? I know. And it was part of, part, part of my uh, recovery time during that time was this realization and, and adopting the mindset of that phrase, my health is my future. My health is my wealth. You all type that in the comments. I don't want you to forget that. That is so important. And if you've never experienced a health challenge that is taking you out of the game and living your best life, like I want to equip you and empower you not to get that low because a lot of times we create those situations for ourselves, right? Carmel? Yes. That stress will mm -hmm. do that number to you. Mm -hmm. Stress and not working out. Not, I wasn't working out. I wasn't eating well. I wasn't um, drinking enough water. Emotional highs and lows. Yes, too much of that craziness. <laughs> so anyway, we're teaching you that stuff, and it's exciting. So thanks for tuning in. We'll be going live with that very, very soon. Um, so do stay tuned. Make sure to click that follow button. If you're catching the replay, type replay. If you shared it, thanks for sharing. And shout out to each of you guys for showing up tonight. I hope you found this valuable. And leaders, this is all you have to do. You just do a quick interview like this and share your simple steps. Share what it's done for you and for your co-host. And that's it. With techno technical challenges too, it's okay. <laughs> yeah, look at us. Neither of us are all freaked out. <laughs> or, or, or shutting down or... Any of that stuff that people can do. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so thanks for tuning in. I can, I can see um, Amber, Claudia, and, and Laura. I can see you all, your little icons at the top of my screen here. So hey, Sonia, I see you too. <laughs> hey, Jeff. Um, thanks for your tuning in, you guys. If you enjoyed this, please drop a comment and let us know what you liked about it. Um, or if you have questions, you can private message us or private message the person that shared this video with you. Um, if you all are a promoter, please do share this with someone that you know was skeptical, that you know hasn't been prioritizing themselves, but is very complaining a lot. Negative, commiserating, complaining, gossip, drama. All these people need Thrive. <laughs> yeah in my opinion and i i used to be one of those people right carmel you probably knew me then <laughs> you have any closing thoughts um you know we're here to just inform you if you are skeptical we're here to inform you we want to share stories with you we want to answer your questions so do not hesitate on asking questions but again you only have one li one body in this lifetime. Yep. Why not see what it feels like to feel amazing? Yeah. I always say, ask yourself, what if it does work? Can yes. you hear the donkey braying in the background? No. <laughs> it sounds like a dinosaur. <laughs> <laughs> this whole time, I've been really trying to be focused here on you all. <laughs> I yeah, that doesn't happen. I hear, I hear a donkey over there, and I hear chickens and uh, and sheep over here. <laughs> a lot going on in Montana. <laughs> well, we do have more cows than people. <laughs> All right, we love you guys. Tune in because we will be going live again very soon. I love doing these videos, and if any of you want to interview me for one of your Thrive Lives, send me a message. Love ya. Or Bye. Carmel. Or Carmel. Bye. <laughs> Bye.